Who is doing this reaction is his last competition, So Many Tears, You Summit 2024, but it's all love. Like, the link to the video will be the description below. Go in second month. So let's into this reaction in 3, 2, 1. Wow! <laughs> What's up guys? How are you? I'm actually in the Dunkin' drive through and I feel like this phone I mean, camera is going to fall any minute because you guys know I don't have the best setup. Okay, so I'll tell you what I got here in a second. Oh, dog. oh there you are. Okay. <laughs> yes, um, I'm just picking up a mobile order for Kendall. Okay, thank you. I knew you guys were gonna fall. Okay, hold please. Okay, sorry about that. What's up? Hello, how are you? Okay, I'm taking my glasses off. So, tomorrow, Seb and I leave for Summit, and we're very excited, but I'm busy. I got my nails done. If you follow me, thanks, make sure you follow me on Instagram because, oh, I didn't park. Because you will have already seen my unicorn nails. So, here they are. She did such a good job. They're so cute, right? I'm so happy. And then next week, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna get Serpent and Siren nails. So stay tuned for those because those are gonna be cute. Let's just try my, let's try this. Oh, that's hitting good today. So today I did a cold brew with two cream, three blueberry and three did I do? And three butter pecan. So good. All right, so we're going to go pick up Hampton. Then Eight. I'm going to go home. I haven't started really packing much at all. So did I already say we're leaving tomorrow? Yeah, we're leaving tomorrow. You saw him at Tampa. I've got to pack. I'm washing clothes right now so I can pack some of those things that I'm washing. We're going to pick up Hampton. We're going to go home. Cap has a private at three. So it's just like back and forth, lots of stuff happening. Then I'll be able to pack. Maybe in between me dropping off Seb and Cap. Cap has a private, no, no, okay, Cap has a tumbling private, but she is also, yeah. and so has Seb, and I need to get Brynn. They are working on higher level stunting. I think we forget, like, it's not just about the tumbling, at least at CFA, like, you, they, they really like the full package. Tumbling is great, but if you don't have, love, like, at, like, stunting, if you're not, they want you to be a good base back spot flyer, like, the whole package. So Cap has all the level four, but she really needs experience basing level, level four. four. So that's what she's been wow. working on. seb has been working on it. And Bryn, we need to get Bryn in the gym working on level three something because that's what she would like to do next season. So where did I go with that? Oh, because Cap, we're, Cap's going early to the gym tonight to work on level four stunting. So anyways, these athletes, all of them, I tell you what, they are going in and like so many of them, not just my kids, I'm just talking about a lot of kids. They are going in and everybody is just working so hard gearing up for trials. I'm just so proud, yeah. of, so proud of everybody. Okay, I am exhausted. I think I know why, because I started my period today. I know that's TMI, but I really did. Um, and I'm just, I really did not want to be on it for this Tampa comp, so wonderful. Wonderful. But, the unicorns are ready. Watch out. All right, you guys, so. Seb and I have made it to Tampa, and it is Youth Summit time, baby. Youth Summit Tampa. win loading. All right, I'm not trying to jinx it. You never know what's going to happen, but, yeah. but they're going to have a great performance. We're going to have so much fun. We're going to build memories. I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to cry. cry. I'm <laughs> In Toba Like, if you want to see more, it's all love reactions. Toba Like. I'm going to cry. I've already <laughs> cried. Okay, so I'm going to give you a hotel tour. We love... Really nice. It's so nice. The hotel, um, nice. the hotel is nice. We have a great. You know what? Actually, I feel like we got like the handicap room because it's so they much have, bigger. And they have the. Yeah. Yeah. Can I bring him? I gotta make sure. I had to. Uh, I ended up valeting the car. I don't know. Brian. That just was easier. But I'm gonna give you a hotel tour. Then Seb and I are going to. We've been sitting. It's a long drive to Tampa. We're gonna walk around. I want to kind of walk the walk to the convention center, time it, so I can plan everything really good in the morning because I have to be there super early. 
Our hotel is connected to Starbucks, so that's a big win. So let's give you guys a little hotel tour. And first, I'll look at Summit. How cute is it? Hop in, ladies. We're going to use Summit. What movie? Okay, so here we go. Um, ooh, it's kind of blindy. We're staying at the Hyatt place. Never stayed here, but it's a great location. We're on the 12th floor. So um, we have a really nice big bathroom. I'm kind of not sure how to work these lights. They're fancy. Okay, there we go. Really pretty. I feel like this hotel is maybe a little newer. I don't know. It smells clean. Yeah, like a little. Yeah. What's that? What's what? In the, In the corner? Oh, a mat. It is a handicap room. We did get a handicap room. It has. It just makes for more like space for a wheelchair. Nice mirror. Check your fit. Um. So yeah, we have a couch. It folds out to a bed. We won't need it because um, it's just seven I right now. Daniel will be joining us tomorrow night, so he does miss day one, but he will not miss day two. So I guess you could put some luggage here. We don't need coffee because we're going to go to Starbucks. But yeah, here's the beds. It really, this this is so much room. Like, this would be perfect for the girls, like, makeup and all of this. Like, this would be a great full-fledged yeah. comp hotel. And we, we, did, we came to Tampa um, at the beginning of the season. And I think I'd, we had, we stayed at the embassy, but I like this hotel better. I don't know, I feel like, but the embassy did have a lot of room, but it's just kind of older. Anyways, nice TV. Our view is really fun, cause we have a view of downtown uh, we're, and we're high, so that makes it even more fun. But yeah, so we're gonna, I'm not, the guy said it was super close, but I'm not sure where the convention center is. I, why do I feel like it's that way? I don't know, that's why I wanna walk it. He said it was on this street, but I feel like he meant that street because that's where we were before we got to our room. So yeah. we have plenty of time. It's a beautiful day. We've been sitting, so we're gonna Walk take a little around. tour. Maybe we'll take you with us. You ready? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's go. All right. You ready? Mm -hmm. You ready to put on a magic show? Ding, ding, magic. All right, day one, let's do it. Got our star beat. Yes, walking so downtown. It's a beautiful crisp morning in the 60s and I'm freezing. <laughs> All right, can you hit that button? Sorry, we're working together here. Please, please. All right, guys, good morning. It's really early. Day two. Yesterday was a whirlwind. I didn't film, <laughs> wow. I didn't vlog. Yeah. But I'm going to give you like the full story later because yesterday was unbelievable. We, we are so proud of the unicorns. We are so happy to be making it today too. Mm -hmm. um, they're gonna do great, we're excited. Yesterday was long, lots of emotional. tears, so emotional, but we're so proud. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna put in the reveal right now of them making it to day two, and then I'll explain later why it meant so much. All right, guys, I have the unicorn himself sitting here, the famous unicorn. He is famous mm -hmm. now. Actually, he's, he is famous. Um, he's varsity famous because varsity is <laughs> I can't even talk about it. If you follow me on Instagram, I keep telling you, follow me on Instagram, then you're gonna hear about these things before I tell, tell, tell you. So during unicorns, well, in the beginning, when Seb came out onto the mat for a second day, I always, I always do, I do hearts, so, I do hearts and I hold up my hand, number one, because I want um, Seb and the girls to always see where I am. I have my place that I always stand. And yes. they always give me like a head nod that they, and a smile that like Bryn will always nod her head when she sees me to let me know she's, she's, she sees me. I just like to connect with them that way. And Seb usually can always see me because his position is usually like right I'm up front, in, um, yeah. front in the middle kind of, so he can see me. Anyways, Cap's in the back holding a sign. She, Cap, you see me always or no? Sometimes. So sometimes she can see me, sometimes not. It just depends. Anyway, so yeah, this time I, I did my heart, yes. and for the first time, Seb did a heart back to me. I lost it. Lost my mind. Oh, I was already crying. Did you just see me actually boohooing? I saw you at the start. I saw you crying, and I knew you didn't see it, so I held it up longer because <laughs> your eyes were closed. You were like, Aah. I literally was. And then when you opened your eyes, you were like, Aah. Oh yeah, I, just, <laughs> I was done. So Varsity happened to capture that a picture of him doing it, and they posted it um, to on their Instagram, and so oh. CFA did too. And I, it was just, I don't know, it was just a really sweet moment captured, and I'm so glad and Varsity captured it too. So I'm just gonna sum up. We're gonna sum up a little bit, talk about the weekend, and it was 
absolutely incredible. The highs and lows are amazing. This is why I love cheer because it's unpredictable. There's highs and lows and that's what makes it fun. And um, first day, unicorns, you know what? It's so unpredictable that sometimes things happen on the floor that you would never expect. Unicorns has been one of the most consistent yes. teams and they always hit zero at comps. And their first day they didn't hit zero. And it was hard and it was hard to watch because it was just one of those things. Yeah, you can't predict crying. nobody's fault, huh? Everyone was, Everyone was crying. It was just, this is how the sport goes. And we honestly, after that, that what happened, we did not think we'd make it to second day. We really didn't. <laughs> yeah. And it was really hard because we're like, we don't want unicorns to go out like that. And so reveals came and Seb, of course, always has his phone when he's filming like placements, you know, awards. And, and this time was his first reveal ceremony for Summit and he, he filmed. The reaction, and I'll insert that for you guys. But we're all the moms are standing back holding hands and when they get to who what teams went, you know, going to second day and, and we heard here cheer Florida unicorns, I, I that moment we lost it and we cried and we boohooed because we were so happy that unicorns was given a second chance because they deserved a second chance because they it was just like a one of those things that happened that was just unexpected. I've yawned four times while you've been filming. Oh, thank you. So am I boring to you? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm boring. So, uh, reveals were amazing. And then we had a pizza party um, after, and that was so much party. fun. And, and then, then they had a practice because they wanted them to have a big practice for about an hour and a half there. And then um, we got to come into the room and they did all their um, elite stunts for us. And we were just cheering them on. There's another yawn, by the way. They were cheering them on. They looked so good and we were so happy. Um, and then Any second day sleep. came and that's when you did the hard thing, huh? I need more sleep. You do need Cause more I've been sleep. waking up You woke six. up, I know. And then you woke up early with me this morning. Oh, and yeah. so second day they did amazing and it was beautiful and sad and all the emotions because this was the last time that unicorns was gonna be the unicorns that we have grown in love all season. And they they did that. They pulled together and they recovered and they put on a beautiful beautiful performance. And when yeah. it was over, like I just boohooed because I was like, that was it. That was the last time Seb would ever be a unicorn because he ages out of youth. Um, he has very exciting things coming for next season and he's ready and we're ready for that. Junior. Following in the footsteps of his sister. Anyways, they at, at placements at re rewards. You know, we weren't sure where they were gonna place. Coming back from such a hard day, we were like, "What?" You know, and it, that day didn't count anymore, so it wasn't yeah, like just so. It started over, so hard. thank goodness. And we were up against some amazing teams. There were some really good youth two teams there, like so good. I mean, it was so fun to watch them. So they started at like. This was 15 teams and we went 15, 14, 13, 12, 10, or 11, I can't count, 11. <laughs> and then they were like, okay, now you're top 10. And we're like, okay, if we just get 10, like we'd be happy. And they got fifth. They got fifth and we're so, so proud. The top yep. five teams were amazing, fifth incredible. In fifth in the country, like 
so much to be proud about. So, so, so much to be proud. I am, I just, I can't, I can't tell you how proud I am and grateful for such an amazing year. And the coaches are just spectacular. Like those three coaches, Rob, Jaden, and Coach McCoy, like, appreciate them a lot because they really put together such a an amazing team a beautiful routine and all three yeah. of those coaches just really pour their heart and soul into that that team and and you can see it and really that group of athletes became friends family and it is because of their relationship that they worked so well together and they performed so well and I don't know, I just think their relationship is what, it matters. I'm telling you athletes, your relationship with your fellow teammates matters. It will translate on the mat. If you don't have good camaraderie and a good relationship with your teammates, it's gonna show up on the mat, it always does. Don't ever think that you can have beef with people on your team and then it won't, it won't affect your time on the mat. It 100% does, it, and it will. And yeah. I think Unicorns is a testament to how close they were and how well they worked together. They trusted each other, the flyers, trusting their bases and just the, the bases and the back spots working together and the flyers, like it just was so beautiful to see a youth team do. And their routine is hard for, for a youth, it's hard. It's, it's, it's a hard, really? it's a hard wow. routine that they just- You look, know, you look it's like a- uh, So anyway, New oh, Summit was amazing. Yes. I, I'm. I'm sad, you know, happy and sad we're closing the chapter on youth, but, you know, we're expecting... He got his pants backwards. Is pocket it... in, pocket out. Pocket in, pocket what? out. Is something... Bones. Show everybody pocket in, pocket out. Pocket in, in. Oh, pocket out. This is what happens when he, when he dresses himself. Hey, good job, Bones. Yeah. <laughs> Did you have anything to, that you'd like to tell the people of the internet? I love your mom, too. You want mommy's coffee? Yeah. All right, jingle, jingle, jingle. Anything else? Anything else? Anything more important? Uh, no. Okay. All right. Now, um, I will be preparing this week for. Oh no! Okay. There's poop. Oh. Pebo. Oh. What happened? Pebo. Pebo had poopy caca. She went to the litter box, but wasn't stayed fully on. It stayed on a little bit. That's the problem with long hair kitties. Anyway, so now I'm, pre I'm prepping for Big yeah. Summit. Big Summit, here we come. Seb's gonna come along for the ride and support his sisters. So that that's coming, and then that's the end of season. And then we're done. Wow. Tryouts. And tryouts. And then really, it's it's very fast. You have tryouts, you have reveal, like the next day or two, Team then team practices start. So we just keep going, like it really doesn't end. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, that's it. Really. love you guys. And we'll see you in the next video. That was its last competition, so many tips, U Summit 2024, but it's all love. The link to the video will be the description below. Go and check them out and pop a like if you like. And comment down below if you want to see more reactions like this one. And subscribe if you are new. And click the bell to be notified when I upload. And bye. Mm -hmm.